This is Dr. Hartzler on dressings and wound care after a shoulder surgery with an open incision. If you're watching this, you probably had a shoulder replacement or a fracture surgery with a larger incision, usually on the front of the shoulder. We close these incisions with layers of absorbable stitches that are under the skin, and there's usually nothing on the outer surface that needs to be removed in the office. There are two layers of dressings that we place in the operating room, and there is no need to directly look at the incision after surgery. We keep this covered, and we just observe the dressings. From the day of surgery until your first visit in the office, which is about a week or a week and a half after surgery, keep the outer rectangular dressing in place. We will take this off in the office as shown subsequently in the video. Check it daily, and some small spots can be normal, but any drainage or leakage is abnormal and you should call us as soon as possible if this happens. You can take a shower the day after surgery with these dressings in place, but you need to cover everything over with plastic because they are not waterproof. Between the first and second visits after surgery, which is usually four to six weeks, there will be the tan epicele dressing that you see here in place. Please check this daily. It may peel off over that period of time, and if it has not come off by the second office visit, PA Sagala or I will remove it. You can shower and let soap and water run over the epicele dressing. Some dry spots of blood are normal. Drainage or leakage from around the epicele is never normal, and you should call us as soon as possible if this is seen. Three other frequently asked questions and their answers are seen here. If you have any questions about the incision or wound care after surgery, don't hesitate to ask us.